Hey guys, Alza Mage here, and I am back with another subscription box, but this time it is not makeup. It is food! By a company called Grays. Basically what the premise is is that every week or every month, depending on how you have your subscription set up, they will send you eight different snacks that are customized to basically um, what you say that you like and you don't like in food, and you get that for $14 and it's an eight pack box of snacks. And I thought, oh hey, that, that sounds pretty interesting. Might as well give it a go. See how big the snacks are that they send how good they are, things like that, and they're supposed to be super, super healthy for you. A lot of it focuses around protein, and nuts, and fruit, and things like that, um, which you kind of don't really see in my box because of what they sent me, but basically they have 109 snacks, and you can go through, and you can say what type of fruits you don't like, what type of nuts you don't like, what type of um, carbs you don't like if you're avoiding dairy, if you're allergic to whatever, and they'll keep that all in mind when they make this box for you, and then you can also go through all 109 snacks and say whether you like it, love it, are interested in trying it, or if you hate it. And they automatically put everything that you say you don't like, so like, I don't like bananas, so every single snack that had bananas in it, they automatically put it into the hate it pile. You can go back and change that to a like it or a try it, or a love it if you really like it. And then every month, week, whenever, after you get your box, you can um, say whether or not you liked the snack, you loved it, you hated it, if you want to try more of it, things like that. And then they also have full-size quantities of these snacks that you can go and purchase from their shop portion. So if you get something that you try and you like, absolutely love it, have to have more, and you don't want to like take the chances that comes in another sample box, then you can go and just individually purchase that. Um, so it's a really interesting concept. I am super excited to try it. I actually got this one as a three item um, when I signed up for a credit card recently. They're like, oh hey, here's some coupons, and I was like, thanks. So that's how I ended up with it. Um, but I like the concept around it, and I'm very interested in trying these. In this video itself, in this sitting, I will not eat every single one of these snacks, because that's a lot of consuming, and I also just had lunch. And I also don't want to go through this box of snacks that fast. But yeah, so, the outside of the box, it's all nice, has lots of pictures. Yeah, greys. So here is the inside. It's all very nicely put together. It has- it does have a really nice packaging, I will admit that. Um, I did already go through and like, rifle around and look at what I got this month. I'll continue to tell you, of course. Um, the packages, they're not sticky, but it does feel like there's something on them, which I don't really like. But it's not sticky, it might just be the texture of the plastic they're using. But, the snacks that I got this month is a cranberry and hazelnut toast with a rich cocoa dip. And there's that. Also gives you the calorie count right here, in case you are on a diet trying to count your calories and things like that. Um, this is a new item. It says new. I thought the toasts were going to be a lot bigger than that, but you can see they're- these are really tiny portions. Not tiny portions. They're- they're appropriate for the snack size of a conscientious- conscientious individual, whereas me goes through a large bag of potato chips in one sitting. Yeah. Um, and then this is a vitamin C crush with pineapple, mango, and coconut. 50% of your daily value of vitamin C per serving. Only 100 calories and there's a lot of fiber in it. So I guess it also says like other things that are good about what you are trying. This is a cinnamon pretzel which has pretzel, cinnamon, honey, almonds. And it is 120 calories with vitamins and minerals. And then we have some kettle corn, sweet and salty, salty half popped corn kernels. There is fiber in them, so I guess it's a healthy type of popcorn. So I know regular popcorn doesn't have much of anything. Then there's a nice divider between the two pieces. Also, you get a coupon 
I think this is just a code used for everyone, so I'm not too concerned. But for a home chef service, uh, basically you sign up for that and they ship you meals per week. That's $30 off your first one. Oh boy. Um, then I have the booster seeds with essential nutrients, sunflower, pumpkin, and flaxseed. I've never had just straight flaxseed. It's a good source of protein and there's vitamins and minerals. This does not have a calorie count on it though. But yeah, there's that. Nice handful of nuts. The flaxseed are like super, super electrostatic. You can see them like sticking on the top. Then I have some sweet mustard ranch, pretzel, sour cream, and onion cashews, and mustard breadsticks. Right here. It's 130 calories. Yep, 130. And then we have the apple and cinnamon flapjack, rustic rolled oat flapjack with apple and cinnamon. Lots of whole grains in there. By flapjack, it's literally just like a granola bar. It's a weird name for granola bar. And then chocolate pretzels, lightly solid pretzel sticks with a cocoa and hazelnut dip. It's basically Nutella. That's what that is. So they're all single serving portion sizes, which like, it's good to be smart about what you're doing. I like to binge eat though, so that's kind of upsetting to me. But this is definitely the healthier way of doing things. Um, and I will go ahead and try one of the products right now. This might just cut towards a slow bit of me eating and then just the end. I don't want to sit here and eat it all because that would be a boring video. But I'm going to try the vitamin C crush that has the pineapple, mango, and coconut. So. It's really open to... It's really easy to open package. It smells good. That smells really good, actually. A little coconut shaving. Not sure if I've ever had straight coconut, actually. All right, straight coconut's not too bad. It's not the most interesting thing in the world, but it's not bad. I think this is a piece of mango. I've never had plain mango, so this is gonna be really interesting to find out if I like mangoes or not. Alright, so I just wanted to add on some things to the end of this video of I have gone through and tried all of the Grace products now and I wasn't that thrilled with it. The taste wasn't too great. Most of the things that I got tasted stale. Like all the things with the pretzels and the toast, it, it just didn't taste right. It tasted kind of like water had gone into it or like humidity. It, to accurately describe the taste, it's like when you leave a bag of popcorn out overnight and you live in a very humid state. That is what this tasted like. And it didn't make me too thrilled with this product, so I'm not getting it again. And I'm not even going to leave a referral link down below because... I didn't like it, I'm not going to tell you guys to go eat it because it wasn't great. I don't want the free stuff that referral link would give me. But like, the other parts of it were okay. I, I will say that the ranch one with all the little chips and stuff, that one didn't taste well. That one was alright. And the cocoa dip with the cranberry toast, the dip itself tasted fine. It's just the toast taste, tasted kind of stale. And that that's kind of what I got with all of the other things. Like the fruit, the nuts, those were fine. That's really hard to get stale though. So like, that might have been why it was fine. But yeah, that's my end opinion to this.